Ikazo guys <clears throat> Oh god <clears throat> What was that? Alright, sorry Ikazo guys, Assassinize one here Starting my new Let's Play on Assassin's Creed 3 for the Playstation 3 Oh wow, that was kind of cool And here's a little funny story I was recording this before But like, I recorded twice actually I, rec I was recording this before And the thing that happened is like My <laughs> my The mic that I record from Was muted and i was like what's going on why doesn't it record my audio and i'm like what's wrong with audacity i'm like freaking out and stuff and then it just figured that it wasn't it was on mute and i just figured out now and i was like was that it and then i tested it and it was all right so that kind of made me a little mad but you know i get over things quickly so let's go to our options here and let's see languages um spoken language english subtitles language english ah Alright, so, oh, we actually have to do it in-game to put the subtitle on, so let's go to single player, we'll play the story, start a new game, of course, Assassinize 1, I actually had to delete my old one, people talked about the end of the world. We had to delete my old one because, you know, guys, it was, man, it wasn't recording, and I recorded twice, I was so bad, so this is my third time recording, the audio is finally recording, it's finally, you can finally hear my voice now, and it's, it's awesome. So Desmond's dad is explaining this to us, like what happened to his son and everything, and and how he got abducted, Abstergo, basically the Templars, they they poisoned him, they gave him like knockout something, I don't know, something to knock him out in his drink or whatever, and then they just hooked him up to the machine and was like, let's go. And that guy looks kind of mad. Most know. are held by a single group, the same group that now had Desmond. You know them. We as know them as Sturgo Industries. Sturgo Industries, and they know them as the Templars. As the enemy. Well, we know. Them. Them for thousands you guys don't know. Even now, you know. You the Unless you played Assassin's Creed before. I do. After That's all, Altair. I've seen the truth. That's the beauty and the horror. Of and the that's. Animal. Who's that? Oh yeah, that's Ezio. It's like I knew that guy. That was just, just testing the power to change everything, to show his history the way it really happened, up until its creation. To the victor went the spoils, went the truth. We're trying. This is so long, guys. This is like five minutes long. But there's only so much we can do. And the Templars. See, look at those Templars. We we can't even see them. Like their faces are so ugly. Assassins and Templars is approaching, bigger than all of us. And if we can't find a way to stop it, these next few weeks will probably be our last. Everyone's last. In the end, it all comes down to him. To Desmond. Through the Animus, he discovered his heritage, explored the Hey, there goes Altair. Covered their secrets. And it's Ezio. Done, he, trained. he used another ancestor to provide decades of experience in the span of a few days. It worked. <laughs> and there goes Desmond. Hope. Soon, though, soon we'll know that ominous date fast approaches, December 21st, 2012. None of us knows what it'll bring, only that this is where they want us to be. When December 21st, 2012. That when is real because we were, the world was supposed to end. If you guys can't see my air quotes, but I'm air quoting, was supposed to end December 21st, 2012. And now, now it's all weird. Uncertain motives. Cause the ones it's like December 30th pieces. now when I'm recording this, this is and, led him. and I'm still here. I hope you guys are still he there because I'm still the here. To this long lost place, armed with the knowledge of Altair and the abilities of Ezio, he holds in his hands the apple of Eden and we stand at his side ready to support him however we can. His name is Desmond Miles and he has brought us to the end. Desmond. So we're in a car right now, or a truck, whatever this thing is. A vehicle. Yeah, we'll call it a vehicle. We're in a vehicle right now. I can't move or anything. I'm just chilling. I guess we gotta get out. Wow, Dad's all old. <laughs> Desmond looks all 
HDFI'd. It's kind of weird seeing Desmond like this. Not used to this. Let's go. All right. Oh wow. Uh, I, gu I guess I don't have to carry anything. Well, that's good. I didn't want to carry anything anyway. I'm glad you guys didn't ask. It's all. I think they have the animus and everything. I don't know. Who cares? Let's just go. I've played this part already, so I kind of know what's going to happen. I want this to be a blind let's play. But me being stupid, not checking my audio to see if it was recording. Uh, it's alright. It's okay. It's whatever. We good. It's fine. Alright, so... The Apple's responding to this place with a whole bunch of graffiti disrespect my heritage. How dare they? Oh, wow. It's like magnetic. The Apple just goes in there. <clears throat> What's wrong with my voice? Gosh. In another moment, down went Alice after it. Never once considering how in the world she was to get out again. This is weird, guys. So, Desmond's gonna move on. I don't know how they're gonna get under there with those big boxes. You're just gonna have to push them under there or something. Alright, so, you guys ready? You guys ready? I'm ready. Oh, wait, whoa, crap, what? Oh, well, that saved us a mile, I guess. Look at that. I think we can, yeah, we can run now. Excuse me. Let's get this over with. Another little cutscene. Wow. Well, we're Desmond here. thinks we're here. <laughs> Alright, let's do this, Desmond. Whoa. Hey, I lost my light. That's not cool. Alright, let's do this. Come on. Da 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 da. Jump. Na 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 na. Cutscene again. Desmond, you need a haircut. Oh my gosh, whose fire alarm is going off? It's I hope I hope my mic doesn't pick it up. Oh, this is strange. Oh my gosh, what's... <clears throat> mm, excuse me, guys. Something's wrong with my throat. Gosh. Oh, wow, all this light. This is really... This is a lot of stuff, man. They must have put a lot of thought into doing all this. Like, what made them think of putting a whole all this in it? Like, what the heck? Oh, another thing is, I was thinking about getting this game for the Wii U, but I was like, you know what, I know how to play it on PlayStation, I might as well just keep going with it. You must find Wait, someone's talking to us. Wait, what? Son? Sir? Aw, oh, Desmond. <sighs> Here we go again. Wow, Desmond just passed out. Desmond? Do you hear us? Uh, yeah. What happened? The temple triggered a bleeding effect. You collapsed and entered into a fugue state. So naturally, you dropped me into the Animus instead of, I don't know, making sure I was okay? <laughs> you weren't in any danger. Besides, the temple appeared to be communicating with you. And I didn't want to risk severing the connection. At least not until we knew what it wanted. Of right. course. <laughs> of course. Son, I... No, it's fine. I get it. And I know what I'm looking for, by the way. It's a key. Oh, wow, he's talking. Just no idea where it is, though. I guess that's why she triggered the bleeding effect. She? Juno, Dad. 
She's talking to me. Oh wow, what just happened? Oh. Okay, Desmond. While you were uh visiting Constantinople, we picked up a software update for the Animus. I'd like to run a couple of quick tests, make sure there aren't any major issues. All right. What do you need me to do? We'll start simple. Walk to the marker over there. All right, we're just gonna run over there. It's gonna tell us how to run. Yep. Yeah. yeah. Who cares? All right. Here we go. First marker down. Okay, Desmond. Let's practice climbing on these objects. I wonder why, like, they have it, have it like this and not in any other kind of form. This wood is. All right. So we go up here. Oh, wait. Alright, alright, I saved myself. There we go. Go up here. Da -da -da -da. Let's go around. And there was this one part I was stuck at. I probably, I, I won't get stuck at it anymore. I know what to do now. So, it's, 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 it's gonna come up soon, guys. So, like, just prepare for it. Like, I'll tell you when I get there. If I remember. Most likely I will. So, don't worry about it. Alright, so let's get over here. Da da da. Do, do. Yeah, free run. Oh crap! All right, now nah, this isn't it. Let's go. That's a constraint. These are optional objectives. This is fun. Synchronization rate. Just climbing on a whole bunch of blocks. All right, Justin, follow the on-screen instructions. Oh, the ah. did we just smash his head in? Well, that was fun. Ah, uh, yeah. All you have to do here is jump the gap. Jump the gap. Wait, what? Where do we go? Oh, okay, just jump. Alright. So that was pretty easy guys. We just air assassinated, smashed their head into the face into the um into the face. <laughs> What's wrong with the into the wall? Oh not the wall but the ground. Oh, this is the part I was stuck. I was like, wait, how do we get over there? I was like, what? And then I just figured oh crap. I just figured out this is what you do, you just run oh no come on how did i do it last time there we go you just hop on there i was like what but it's good now it's good let's get over here jump on these thingies yeah we jump down here and call it a day and it's like uh it gets all messed up and all synchronized then we turn into this guy i'm like who the heck is this i was like what should be able to build the world. Time to find out what the temple wants from you. Alright. Mission complete and we got full synchronization guys, so that's pretty good. So we're just gonna walk over here. This is the guy we are. I don't know who this guy is. Sir. Everything alright, sir. Yes. Fine. I'm just preoccupied, that's all. Oh. Don't this is the guy we saw that uh, our dad looked like, actually. The Thank guy you. in front of us right Where here. Hold on, let me show you. Uh, I can't run up to him, but the world's building and it looks really cool. And we're just walking to the mission to start. It's not taking too long. So that's the guy that was all like, sir, sir, or whatever. Alright, start the mission, shall we? Invitation. Here's the invitation. Shall I take nah, we good. <laughs> I remember that part. I am loving this Ladies game. And gentlemen, you are requested to kindly find your seat. All right, we have to find our seat now. Good evening, sir. This way, please. Okay. All right, scoop. All right, so scoop, pardon. All right, so we're at our seat. Wait, after after it loads, we're at our seat. Evening, Haytham. Reginald. I can't tell you how happy I was to hear they'd mounted this revival. Gay's best work by far. Have you seen it before? Once, my father brought me here as a child. Though I remember little of it. But I suppose tonight will afford me the luxury of a proper viewing either. No, I'm afraid.
afraid it won't. On to business then. Do you see him? Alright, we're trying to find somebody, as the guy said, so we're gonna press the L3 to trigger our eagle vision, and I remember the guy's up here, so we have to look for the gold target, and the gold target's right there. Some guy with some George Washington curls. Be seated in one of the boxes above. The stairs are watched. We'll need to find another way up. I already have. Alright, so we found a way to get up there. And, um, I guess we have to go talk to that guy. Or ask him something, I don't know. Let's find our seat. I mean, let's find, uh, we have to find a way to climb up that way. Yo, sit down, cuz. <laughs> That's so funny. Like, the guy was gonna get up, he just sat him down. Alright. So, let's climb up here. And the funny thing is, like, we're doing all this and no one can see us. We're, like, in the shadows. And it's a good thing we were all black. So, there's those people. They can't see us. They're trying to see down there. And then, oh, what the heck? Viewer discretion is advised, you all. I am so serious. Like, what are they doing? What are they doing? Oh, wait. Now they're not doing anything. And now, oh, my gosh. Get a room. Why would you come to a show and do that? Like, do that at home. Like, what's wrong with these people? But let's not worry about it. Kids under 17, I advise you to watch this with your parents. If they do not approve. So, we got to our checkpoint. And now we're going to go all the way over here. And then I hate this part so much. I have to pick a lock. I have to really pick a lock. Alright, so let's get in here. We rotate it. We hold. Let's see, do we got it? All right. So we press. All right, we use the R button to get in here, and we have to. Ah, oh, crap. All right. We have we have to use the R button to get in here, and pick, and rotate. Oh, hold on, guys. Oh, sorry guys. Quick move right there. I had to go handle something. Alright. Make sure my mic is on. Okay. Sorry guys. Now I have to do this all over again. All right. Now we break the lock. There we go. Well, that was easy. And now we're backstage behind the scenes. Uh, let's do our assassin stuff. Oh. <coughs> mm, sorry, guys. Alright, so. Do our stuff right here. Get down to business. Go up here. We jump over here. And I don't know how no one saw us. Like, what? What? I don't understand it, but it's a good thing that they don't see us. It really doesn't matter. Wait, come on. Wait, get over there. Oh, there we go. And here we go. And there's the guy we're supposed to assassinate. Sort of 
have come to me. We would have found another way. Yes. But then you would have known. Wow. What is he talking about? For what it's worth. I'm sorry. As am I. Oh, that's so real. And took his pendant. That little boy is scared out of his mind. He did not just tell him shush. That is so real. I've never seen something like that, guys. He just told the boy to shush. And then said hi to those ladies. Like, what? Get out of here. What? Come on now. I never seen something like that, guys. That was really cool, though. Like how they just put that in there. Oh crap! <laughs> DJ just he jumped on him. That was funny. That was hilarious. All right, so we'll do this to you know get this guy out of the way. Excuse me. And we're casually walking. I guess they find found out that the one guy died. But we're trying to hurry up and get out of here because no one knows it's us. Oh wait, wrong way. Ah. All these people are in my way. Oh my gosh, how long do we have to walk? Wow, people are going are really hectic and we're just trying to get out of here. It's cool though. Oh wow, if you can see outside the the thing was building, like that was really cool. I didn't even notice that until now. And then we're at a checkpoint. So we just synchronize fashion in my hat and if this bubble it will no storehouse I'll say same for for Knowledge. Or they must be talking about the first civilization that we saw in the other games, guys. Gentlemen, how fair your calculation! I believe inside. I think this. More, It's a first Call you, you Travel. We're not already in America. Oh, we must be like in England or something. I'm your. Although, but you will recall call this yourself. Of course. Okay. So that wasn't too bad, guys. 
global synchronization. Now we got our nice little hat again. We're walking in the animus. Atlantic Ocean Day 2. Well, that's weird. Well, look at that water. Though. That's, that water looks kind of cool. Looks like we're writing a book or something. Something, something similar to that. I don't know. So we're on a ship, and we have to go to the upper deck. And I'll do that in the next episode, guys. Like, comment.